Hey, what's up guys and good morning. Um, I just finished at the gym here. There's Fit For Less. Um, and I had a great conversation with my friend this morning, uh, a really good colleague, my best buddy, and he's actually just about to get started on a little side kind of gig himself. And he actually was asking me about CRM. Now, interestingly, this is actually the guy who actually taught me about Infusionsoft, about Keep. And he was asking my advice on like, hey, what do I need for platform and what do I need for this and that? So, um, and hopefully you guys can hear me all right. I'll throw some captions in this video afterwards. But anyway, so, um, yeah, my caption is don't buy keep unless you meet these three criteria or the three criteria. Number one is um, invoicing and quotes. And so if your sales process, if you're already really tied in and set on using QuickBooks for quotes and invoices, uh, don't don't get keep because that's a, a major part of the functionality of keep. And by the way, keep has two products, keep and Infusionsoft by keep. Uh, keep is the one I've been demoing a lot lately and I have a video on my Facebook page about it. So uh, that's what I'm referring to. Infusionsoft by Keep is a different story. It's, uh, it's for high growth surplus providers, people who want to have a lot of scale. I'm going to circle back to that. So number one, if you are already t super tight in for QuickBooks and aren't opening, open to doing that inside of your CRM, don't get Keep. If you're open to doing that uh, quoting and invoicing inside of your CRM, Keep might be a great fit for you. Number two is appointment scheduling. If you don't use appointments at all in your business, Keep might not be the best product for you. But if you want native appointment scheduling, which means that people that you can, from within your CRM, send out an email to your prospects and clients saying, hey, or book an appointment with me. If you do that, then Keep might be your product for you. If you don't, once again, if you don't use appointment scheduling in your process, um, then don't worry about it. And then finally, um, your sales process. If it's like a really quick, you know, sales process where it's, where it's just like you have one meeting and they're bought, um, Keep might not be the option. They have a, a sales pipeline type feature where you can have multiple stages, new lead, discovery, proposal sent, proposal accepted, um, you know, ready to pay and then paid. Um, if that's kind of like what your process is, you need to keep track of those people. You know, if you only have like one or two of those people at, at a time, once again, Keep probably not for you. If you have five, 10, 15 of those people at a time, it might be for you. If you have 50 or 100 and you have a large sales team, once again, Keep is probably not for you. You might consider looking into Infusionsoft by Keep. So those are the three criteria for Keep. That's appointment scheduling within your CRM. You, you use appointments. Um, you're open to doing a quoting and invoicing through your CRM and then the long sales process of, of that. And I'm just walking around downtown here just uh, to get my body moving. I, once again, I was super excited to share with this with you guys um, because that conversation with my buddy this morning fired me up. And, uh, and I wanted to make sure you guys knew that I'm not just, I'm, I'm about your vested interest and not just that. So I said that I was going to share about two other platforms, HubSpot and Active Campaign. So I will start with HubSpot because a couple of people have asked me about that recently. HubSpot, I've actually talked to other people in the Keep community. HubSpot is an unbelievable product. Super great functionality, absolutely amazing. And the CRM is free. So if you're only looking for a CRM, a lot of people that I talk to don't actually know what CRM means. Uh, CRM is only managing, only holding information about your prospect. It's not emailing, it's not scheduling, it's not like that type of stuff. Although, excuse me, HubSpot does have a native appointment scheduling feature in it as well. I'm just gonna switch hands here. Uh, but emails and automation and marketing processes, that's not CRM. That's something called marketing automation or email autoresponder. And by the way, I'm gonna to touch on um, MailChimp as well. So if all you need is CRM and you don't wanna send any emails, you don't wanna do any marketing, like do any email promotions, you don't need any processes where somebody signs up for something and then they get these series of nice emails, go ahead and use HubSpot. Um, that's perfectly fine. And, and I don't know what, what their e-commerce, uh, what their ability for, for that is, but anyway, if that's all you need, if you need other things, HubSpot is, one, this is really important, an enterprise level solution. I, uh, an agent, a fellow agency owner had a client who just wanted to send somebody opts in for something and they want to send them three emails, three nice design emails to try to get them to schedule, get get a quote with them. And it, they needed to go up to HubSpot's $800 a month um, uh, level. So a lot of small business owners, medium sized business owners, that's not realistic for them. So that's basically HubSpot. Once again, if you only need a CRM, 
and make sure you're clear about that, then you have a spot. If you need other things, you need to look at another solution like Keep, like Infusion Stop by Keep, or like Active Campaign. I had a great conversation with uh, one of my mentors yesterday about Active Campaign versus Infusion Stop by Keep. And I'm like, what's the difference? You know, he's like, and he's really, really digging Active Campaign, especially for people who have less than 2,000 contacts and probably plan to not scale super fast. If you're planning to scale super fast, you're planning to grow grow really fast, um, something that's really important to realize is it takes time to migrate your, your, your information, your contact, your database from one system to another. Not all of it transfers over. So you do wanna be picky, but also you don't wanna get something before you need it as well. And so when you're just starting off, you wanna do some marketing, you wanna have a CRM, check out Active Campaign. I'm gonna actually check it out right now and sign up for the free trial just so that I know or whatever they have, uh, just so I know what it's like and how it differs from Keep or Infusionsoft by Keep. So Active Campaign, they have a very, very um, low barrier of entry. Their, their price point, starting price point is very low. I don't actually know what it is. I think they have a free version and then other cheap versions. Keep, on the other hand, starts at $99 a month and starting April 1st, Infusionsoft by Keep starts at $199 a month and those are in American dollars. A lot of these CRMs um, are in American dollars. So. That is a bit about Active Campaign, and then MailChimp. Uh, I was actually just literally this morning talking to somebody, and they had used MailChimp. MailChimp is basically, um, from what I understand, an autoresponder. You can actually apparently, and there's some mud right there, so I'm not going to go that way. Um, you can you can send uh, some automated email marketing, like have a bit of logic, but you need to pay for their higher versions, and it's not just a, a very robust product. Is from what, what I understand, if somebody just wants to send out emails to a list of their 500, 100, or 50, 100, 1,000 people or whatever, and all they need is like one-way communication and, uh, and all that, then that's good. Now, an important also thing is if you really need your emails to get through the people, email deliverability is something that you need to look into. Different platforms have different um, levels of email deliverability. Infusionsoft is a, by Keep is actually one of the leaders in uh, deliverability, despite the fact that some people kind of complain about it, it's mostly because everybody using Infusionsoft by Keep are marketers and they're really paying attention to their open rates versus people who are just kind of business owners and they're just like, I need to just do, do something, send out my um, email newsletter, not as not as picky about the results they get. So um, anyway, that's an overview of those platforms. Keep, Infusionsoft by Keep, which I actually, I'm going to talk about that right now, but I've already talked about Active Campaign, HubSpot, and MailChimp. I'll talk about Infusionsoft by Keep for a second. I have somebody here locally in Lethbridge, Alberta, that uh, I put onto Infusionsoft by Keep. I'm working with another agency owner on it, and the reason why is they're going to scale fast. I actually just got a new client, uh, American client. I, I serve people internationally um, that um, that is on Infusionsoft by Keep, and they have over a half a million contacts. Okay, if you're that much scale and you need automation and sequences and a one to many. B to C type, definitely, and it's not just B to C. Infusionsoft by Keep, it's B to B as well. But if it's that environment, Infusionsoft at a larger scale is an amazing product. Um, so this this client, this new client that I said in Lethbridge, they are going to uh, they're going to scale fast. And if they used Active Campaign, one thing I forgot to mention is Active Campaign gets ex- more expensive more quickly. Um, like I mentioned, so they, they like have to personally quote you after you get over 25,000 contacts. So if you're somebody who wants to do some marketing, some email stuff, you never really plan, you, you want to just get profitable and stay at a certain level um, and not scale super big, which maybe isn't everybody, but, um, or you don't plan to scale super quickly right away and you don't have a lot of contacts right now, um, check out an active campaign. But if you want to scale fast and all that kind of stuff, you might as well start in a system that can handle you know, tens of thousands or even hundreds of thousands eventually contacts. Uh, whereas my understanding is active campaign is just not that. So that's uh, Infusionsoft by Keep. It's, it's the leader. They basically created the marketing automation um, whole uh, market for, for marketing automation for small businesses. It was originally just like a big enterprise solution like Salesforce and, and HubSpot and stuff like that. Once again, those two, they're enterprise level solutions. They're for big businesses that have a lot of money to spend on um, a very robust and complete product. So hopefully this has been helpful to you guys. I, I wanted to share this just because um, I've been, cons- you know, I'm a, I'm a marketing consultant, I do marketing agency work, and I want to do, I don't want to be the person who sells somebody a product that um, just because I only sell one product that 
you know, they're, they're not happy with it and that affects my reputation. That's actually what I told um, this, this prospect this morning. And so those are a bit about the other ones that I'm aware of. Um, if you're interested in Keep or Infusionsoft by Keep, obviously talk to me. If you're interested in ca active campaign and actually signing up for it, let me know because as I shared, my mentor is, uh, is a certified partner and reseller uh, with them as well and, and can help you guys out. So hopefully this has been helpful. Um, please let me know if it was. Um, obviously I'm in like, I'm sweating. So I just finished up at the gym. Um, but I wanted to do it right away and not delay, not procrastinate shooting this video. So um, I care about you guys and my and my my community a ton. Um, go ahead and drop comments below. What do you think? Do you, and if there's any questions, as I always say, uh, feel free to post them below. Take care, guys. See ya.